It is a great pleasure to greet present participants and organizers of GER conference. I am Mildred Zlatic, immediate past president of World Association of Soil and Water Conservation and a professor at Belgrade University at Faculty of Forestry at the Department for Ecological Engineering in Soil and Water Resources Protection. I will present to you a keynote paper entitled Soil Management for Sustainability, Present and Future Necessities. The paper is divided in several sectors, such as environmental degradation with focus on soil and water resources, natural and anthropogenic conditions in positive, in negative as well as in positive sense, preventive measures in erosion and torrent control, soil management for sustainability, participatory approach, which community-based rehabilitation of natural resources management, and it will be presented model of soil management for sustainability adapted for the uh, hilly areas of Serbia. Environmental degradation is presented here through the simple model regarding environmental impact through the number of connected to the number of people, resource use per person, environmental impact per unit of resource used. World population is estimated to be a little more than 9 billion at the mid-century and global land quality uh, with regard to land surface and population distribution is presented here to the land quality class, total land surface and world population. And it is interesting that on the best first class is occupied only 2.4% with the people of about 6%. The most occupied are fourth, fifth, and sixth class with about 54% uh, of world population on a surface of about 34%, and uh, which is saying negative. On the worst classes, eight and nine, it is occupied about 45% of land surface. Uh, soil erosion is the enemy of the state number one. Uh, number one. It is evident in law of conversation land in the United States, originated in the dramatic circumstances of economic depression of the 30s of last century, as well it is also evident in Serbia in a law of regulation of torrent floods during time of King Alexander in the 30s of last century. Flash floods and natural and anthropogenic hazard. Uh, here is presented the great floods in Serbia. We have great floods in May 2014. This is a part of West Serbia. Uh, it was extreme meteorological event. Where here in, in, in these blue areas for three days dropped down about 400 millimeters, which is a half of annual participation for Serbia. These are photos from Krupanj in West Serbia. This is also part of Krupanj watershed Chajavica. This is center of Krupanj. Uh, anthropogenic and human activity can be not only negative, but also the positive. The impact of human activity Activities on soil is presented here through the, this slide of European Commission from Joint Research Center from ISPRA in Italy, when you can see all the activities through the uh, manures, using manures and fertilizers and, and accumulated heavy metals in soil, using pesticides and herbicides and causing contamination of soil, using heavy machinery. Uh, influencing compaction of soil or soil erosion depending on land use but uh, the most important in negative is this ceiling which is not only important for Europe but also wider. 
This is a slide from West Serbia in May 2014, this great flooding and slope uh, where is uh, production on, uh, of a raspberry planted down the slope and it causes in this great flooding this landslide. Negative interference, so we presented here to the non adequate tillage, which can cause the more than uh, soil loss more than tolerant. This is uh, Gerdaichka Gorge, one of the most endangered areas in Europe in the mid 50s, and the negative human interference is presented through the cutting leaves of the forest uh, for the winter cattle forage and it caused uh, it caused the stopped functioning of the protection forest protection so it caused accelerated erosion in this period also negative interference is through the construction of objects in the profiles of regulations and preventive measures in uh, protection of torrential floods can be divided into integrated planning basins through the technical and biological works and sustainable management of natural resources. When we talked about sustainable, we first cross to the unsustainable development. And uh, it is presented here uh, during the ISCO conference in Morocco in 2006, on excursion day, organizers took us to the Atlas area. And here, this in this green zone, every three to five years are great flooding and several thousand dead people. Uh, because it is incredible behavior not to build the settlements in the upper part of the green area, which is endangered by floods. It is uh, difficult, but more most safer. Or establishing these houses on the top of the hills, stone houses also exposed to wind and the water. Or construction settlements in a protect, uh, potentially affected areas, as it is here, the example of Alps near landslide. Or uh, these buildings built uh, on the top of, of some hills of the Himalayas in Nepal. Uh, rest, restaurant or River Shira in Loznica. This is slide from 2014. It exists today, unfortunately. Soil erosion and torrential floods. This is good presented here on a Stara Planina mountain, uh, negative human interference, cutting these trees. It is situation in summer 2006, May 2007, July 2007, August 2007, and September 2007, what can be caused by, by destroying, by destroying uh, protective function of forests. Positive activity is reduced to the sustainable management of land and water resources by the local population. We will present here also examples from local stakeholders through the VOCAT program. Uh, and case study, public participation in decision making of sustainable land resources management in Gerdelička Gorge. Uh, that you say, that I said earlier, that it was one of the most endangered areas of erosion in Europe in the mid 50s. Uh, we have done this process of public participation through the Center for Ecology and Sustainable De Development with local population, production, enterprise cooperative Gerdelica, and the regional chamber of economy Leskovac, cooperative association Leskovac, public water management enterprise Serbia, Wod uh, Serbia Waters, Serbian Waters, through the direct contacts, uh, medias, and questionnaire and debate, which led to the consensus on sustainable land management of the Gerdelička Gorge. To establish on private land on steep slopes, uh, wind yards and orchards production, uh, uh, 
uh, on, on, a, on a conservation on the soil management for sustainability. Uh, this is choice of target groups and locality on the private and distributed land, distributed. Contacts with, you can see very deep discussion with stakeholders, very interested in the program. <coughs> this is participation, very important in medias, through the newspaper, <coughs> evening news, newspaper politics, and the local television Leskovac, which was <coughs> the most important, as we have been 10 minutes on the evening diary of this television. After that, acceptance of this program by villagers was 100%. Questionnaire regarding acceptance of the, the program, I always use a little sense of humor. You can see also the youngers with this smiling accept this program, smiling of this child. Or local stakeholder farmers accepted it, also through the sense of humor. You can see their smiling faces, also big stomachs. Influence of public participation in Gabdaricka Gorge was, as I said, through the medias, debates, contacts, and uh, uh, all this initiative uh, led to the erosion control, environment protection, rising public awareness in decision making on environment, better market supply, economic stability of the region, and in some, in some level, stopping migrations. World Association of Soil and Water Conservation has a, a very, very uh, good program and project called uh, World Overview Conservation Approaches and Technologies, VOCA. Here are some examples from the world, from the Asia and Africa. This is from Kenya and also from South America torrent control from Bolivia, conservation technologies from Bolivia, and how is it functioning as knowledge from the field for the field through the questionnaires on technologies, approaches and maps, database, outputs, tools to document and evaluate local soil and water conservation activities. These database questionnaires on technologies, approaches and maps, database, uh, collected and access to the information in this database to the books, CDs and internet. This is decentralized organization. Uh, in this program are involved uh, many, many uh, important inst world institutions in soil and water conservation. And this yellow is our department for ecological engineering in the soil and water, in the soil and water uh, protection of natural resources from the faculty of forestry. These are examples of WOCAT in Republic of Serbia. This is from South Serbia. And how is it functioning in Serbia? Through, uh, uh, we are the leaders our department at the Faculty of Forestry. It is financed by the Ministry of Agriculture, Forestry and Water Management through the Directorate for Waters. We organize trainings, education, research, revision of collective data, and the results are presented in brochures and CDs. Collecting data is done through the water management enterprises in Serbia. And also it is interesting, we formed students forum of World Association of Soil and Water Conservation branch, Serbian branch. They are also in collecting data involved. This is some example for water management enterprise Loznica, examples of torrent control with these special objects in the West Serbia. And the village slants in Belgrade uh, surrounding 
production on wide terrace in open field and in plastic gardens and production on plastic gardens, as well as special technology agrile textile for covering early vegetables uh, uh, to keep wetness and to protect crops of cold weather when is winter coming and production on tillage made terraces in open field. This is also village slancy overview of tillage made terraces here, questionnaire on the farm. And this is uh, in farmer Georgia, which with the price of Belgrade government for the agricultural production for last year. This is example for the village Granice in Mladenovac community, contour tillage and contour planting of plum orchard. But it is interesting that family Tomicevic also, this is the seller of the family uh, with oak barrel inside is very good plum brandy, which we degustate Slivovic production in the cellar of family Tomicevic. And we say it is soil management for sustainability, also ended by the plant. Oblačinska cherry, very famous cherry, very soft cherry, uh, uh, relics for the South Serbia, planted on the narrow terraces, and blackberries also in the foothill of area in South Serbia. This is tillage made terraces with the grass riders on a 700 about 700 meters above sea level in the Delička Gorge. This is how is it functioning uh, questionnaire of maps regarding this questionnaire and the program. Uh, it is covering administrative units of the state of here of Serbia with the colors depending on uh, different points. For instance, the uh, uh, degradation point or effects of soil and water conservation measures and so on. Demonstration site, it is an example from uh, West Serbia, from the village Gornje Košlje on about 1000 meter above the sea, raspberry contour planting and using uh, organic fertilizers here. Uh, other part of this presentation is model, model soil management for sustainability model in hilly regions, which is connected to the er erosion hazard, depending on the groups of slopes. Erosion hazard is estimated as relation, ratio or relation between uh, present soil loss and tolerant soil loss. Non and, uh, divided on non-endangered, weak endangered, medium endangered, strong endangered, and several endangered regarding this ratio. And this group of slopes, it is established erosion, control crop rotations, classical orchards, orchards with classical terraces, orchards with self-terracing, pasture and forest. Uh, this is example of Topchideska river watershed using this model uh, in ecological point of view. Uh, this uh, here are presented uh, soil loss according to present land use. This is A line. So, uh, tolerant soil loss, this is T here in the middle. And A prim, A prim. Soil loss according to proposed model of production based on soil management for sustainability. And we can see that our model is on ecological stability because soil loss is under tolerant level. Assessment of economic efficiency of this model uh, goes, was run through the internal rate of return, payback period, benefit cost ratio, net present value. Through the model one is presented model. Model two uh, is uh, uh, addition of production of bees as honey and flower powder, powder on the some lines of the model one. 
And model three is only product of royal jelly on some uh, production lines of model one. And we see efficiency, uh, internal rate of return for all models is above 12 percentage, which is the limit of the International Bank for development and reconstruction. Payback period in Serbian banks uh, is effective if it is under 10 years. Here is sensitivity, 10 years and above um, under this level for the model two and model three. Benefit cost ratio is uh, more than one, so it is on the cost of efficiency and net present value much more than zero. You can see results for the 15 years in advance in future. Examples from the world, we have good connection with the, the uh, Institute for Torrent Control in Vienna at Boku University. Uh, flooding control is uh, uh, regarding uh, uh, risk of zones. And in Austria, all these risk zones are, are colored by the different colors. Every color means measures. Red color means nothing. Stabilization, <clears throat> stabilization as stabilization of longitudinal by longitudinal structures in Alps. And uh, I have to say that it is really a sediment management in Alps, what Austrian experts are doing, because uh, these grilled doors are to stop bigger uh, or uh, longer stones and the smaller and smaller are coming downhill and totally to the downstream uh, 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 sediment come as a civil engineering material we have a good connection also with the czech Brno university and we exchange master students every year uh, czech approach to flood control is interesting by the uh, establishing small lakes and the bio, bio corridors in the upper part of these lakes. Uh, we have also very good connection with China institutes in Beijing, uh, Institute for Sediment and Erosion, and also with Institute for Soil and Water Conservation in Yangling in Shanxi province. This is approach to integrated watershed management in China. Uh, Serbian uh, uh, experience in torrent control. This is some uh, Czech dams in uh, Gerderička Gorge. And this is a special object in Lještarska Dolina watershed with using some railway material here when the sediment and water come. Some are stopped in, in, in the back of the object. Uh, some stones cross this part and uh, drop down in front of the object and clean water drop down and go through the channel to another watershed so the village Riboy Vranjski is saved of, of the torrents and flooding torrents flooding this is a special object that we lead students and experts from the other countries, power organization, and so on. And uh, I always finish with the uh, with the stakeholders, mountain stakeholders. They are mainly elderly uh, households, and these two ladies did the questionnaire with them. It was their master master work. And uh, they are very good accepted because every questionnaire, every talk is with a glass of conversation. Glass means a glass of plum brandy, but only one. Thank you very much for your attention. <laughs>